say what, say what, say what You know that I like it, baby Ooh, girl, you know what's up And you know what I need Ooh, say what, say what, say what You know that I'm out at, baby Ooh, girl, you know what's up Hey YouTube fam, it's your girl Gladys. Welcome back to the channel. I create hair, fashion, lifestyle content that'll encourage you to be your very best self. So if you are with that, you are in the right place. Today's Twenty Dollar Tuesday, and on Twenty Dollar Tuesday, we showcase super cute yet super affordable hair and fashion finds for the lovely Twenty Dollar price range and below. Now I know I missed Twenty Dollar Tuesday last week. Some of y'all came at me. I'm sorry, but that's that's what I need. I need the accountability because we're trying to stay on track for the rest of the year, bringing you Twenty Dollar Tuesday every week as well as at least one to two more videos. Y'all know that I brought back Small Talk Saturday and shout outs to y'all that watched my video sharing why I quit my teaching career. That was a very pivotal video for me, so make sure you check that out after this video. But yeah, let's get into today's hair. We're gonna do a half wig again. You said you wanted more half wigs, I got you. This half wig is by Outre and it's from their Converti Cap series. It's called Curls Trip. I love the Converti Cap series. If you haven't tried one of their styles yet, where have you been? Where have you been? They have literally probably over 40 styles now, all different types of textures and colors. It's a really innovative line. I'm so here for it. And that's why I keep buying wigs from this line. Before we get into the hair though, if you are interested in the hair that I'm wearing, this is an Amazon headband wig. I'm loving it. Like this, <laughs> it's like a beautiful lion's mane. And of course the 30 color really sets me off. I'm like in a chocolate mode right now. Let me show y'all this dress. This leather dress. Honey, <laughs> I swear, I can't wait to bring the fashion hauls I have coming next week. I cannot wait. But of course, if you wanna know the tea now on this dress, it'll be linked in my description box. So let's get into Curls Trip, shall we? This is what it looks like. I actually showed this wig before in one of my, I believe one of my 10 cheap headband wig videos. This is the inside of the cap where it has this long comb here in the front and then it has a comb over here in the back. The thing about the Converti Cap wigs is that they lay flatter than the half wigs from back in the day. So it leaves you with a more seamless install. So today we're just gonna talk through this together in real time. I'm gonna show you how I'm going to put this half wig on my head. And I wanna do a half up, half down style because that's my jam, I love it. So we're gonna start by just taking this wig off. You see how easy that was? I have my real hair in the front here. I'm gonna pull that out. And I didn't even straighten this hair, y'all. But I'm gonna show you what I do just to kinda like make it blend. So I'm gonna put my wig cap back on and we're gonna get it popping with the hair today. I'm so excited. I already moisturized my hair. I'm going to be using my Echo Styler Gel today to smooth this back as well as my brush and my She Is Bomb Edge Control. Now let's start by putting this wig on. If y'all have this wig, sound off in the comments. Let me know. You know, when it comes to the comb, sometimes I use them, sometimes I don't. Today I'm going to use them, but normally I recommend wearing a wig grip when you wear any wig so that way you don't have to use the combs because combs can cause breakage y'all all right so this hair you see it right looks like a natural kinky curl type of style like a kinky wave almost and i like the length great everyday length basically all i'm gonna do is just gel this up into a pony okay i'm gathering some of the hair here I'm just literally just grabbing a clump of hair, y'all. Like, it's nothing to it. Once I decide how much hair I wanna gather, I wanna make sure that over here it's not like tracks showing. You know what I'm saying? We don't want that. We don't need to see the tracks. Okay. This would probably a good be a good time to use like a banana clip so that way your hair isn't in the way. But do I have a banana clip on me right now? No. So we just gonna be winging it. It might come out a little messy, but it's all right. I got my Echo Style Gel here, and y'all need to check out my Wigs Essential list on Amazon if you haven't already, because I have everything that I use in that list. I also have put out several videos showcasing 
different wig hacks that I like to do featuring a lot of those items. I did a part one and a part two video. Check that out, y'all. Like, if especially if you're brand new to the wig game or if you're still like a novice, you gotta check out that video. I'm just like globbing this on. I wanna tell y'all like <laughs> globbing it on because I kind of want it to be like slick. You know what I'm saying? Slick. I don't know if it's like the Bronx in me, but it's like the more gel, the better. <laughs> I remember back in the day when girls used to wear their little slick back ponytails, honey. You couldn't tell us nothing about the gel, okay? It was never enough. If you're from New York, shout outs to you. Hey, family. <laughs> so, let me see. All right, I think that's enough gel. I'm just gonna brush this, like so. Oh, man. This, literally, y'all, is gonna take me no time. This type of style takes me, like, no longer than 10 minutes to do. I'm just checking my sides here. Oh no, this is trying to show. You'll notice that sometimes the wig will try to shift back. You can always use a bobby pin to just pin it back in place, right? Now, I know a lot of people with these hairstyles like to do like little fancy baby hairs and whatnot. I'm not doing that today. I'm not really a baby hairs girl at all. Although I do like baby hairs when they actually come from your head. <laughs> When they come from a wig, uh, you know, a lot of y'all be tripping me out with that. And I actually talked about that in my video when I talked about the wig trends that I'm ditching. Y'all had me cracking up with that video. Y'all need to check that out. That's a really good video. All right, so I think I'm ready to just tie the ponytail now. Oh, uh, you know what? I have a better pony. I need to bring this mirror closer to me because I cannot see without my glasses. Pucha, I could not see, so I had to bring my mirror closer. All right, so what I would do here is literally I would just take my hair and just wrap it with a little bit of the hair. Just a little bit of the wig. I'm applying some gel here when I wrap it around. I'm grabbing it and I'm wrapping it around like so. I'm like pulling it and wrapping it very, very taut. I kind of wish this was a little bit longer. I'm gonna snip off some of that because this job is looking a little uneven. That's it, y'all. That's how I style this half wig in a half up, half down style. What do y'all think? Let me know. This is one of those wigs that the older it gets, the better it's going to look. My goodness. I want to brush this out so badly right now, but I know that y'all want to see the natural curl pattern on this, but look at it. Look at how gorgeous and natural this looks. Come on, Utre. Like, y'all, y'all just stay. Y'all kill me with this Converti Cab line. I swear there is something for everybody in this line, especially if you rock your natural hair. There's something for you. And you saw how with this style, I didn't straighten my natural hair out. I literally just moisturized it, swept it up with some gel, and then I wrapped my natural hair around the ponytail for it to blend and voila, we're done. This is cute. Where am I going? My school's homecoming is happening this week. I went to Howard University, HU, you know. If you're a fellow HBCU grad, feel free to say hello in the comments. So I've been just trying to decide how I want to wear my hair. I don't know. I think this is a contender. What do y'all think? I also have another Outre wig, Lucien, that has a beautiful highlight. Oh my God. Shout out to Courtney Janine because as soon as I saw that wig on her, I had to have it. I'm gonna figure it out. But either way, let me know what you think about this half wig. If you're ready to see more half wigs, let me know because I do have more in my stash that I'm ready to pull out and show y'all. Shout out to all of you that are watching with the premiere party. I really appreciate it. You know I love y'all and I love being able to chat with all of you. Also, one more thing I have to tell you. I have to tell you guys, things have been picking up on TikTok, y'all. I had a video go viral, like viral viral, like over a million views viral, and people have been finding me and finding my channel. It's really exciting. So we're at almost 70K on TikTok now, whereas before we were at like 7K. <laughs> it's kind of crazy. So 
come join the family on TikTok. We're really rocking and rolling over there. That was a goal of mine to reach 10K before the year is over, and we did it. And I think I want to do like a little, a little something on YouTube to like commemorate that. I'll let y'all know. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Speaking of upcoming videos, the part two of the Jamaica vlog is coming. I'm almost done editing that. Thank you for your patience. And like I said earlier, I have fashion hauls from Amazon dropping. So I can't wait to show you what I've been finding. The holiday seasons are coming as well. I'm just so excited. Y'all know my birthday's at the end of the year. So it's gonna be a good, solid two and a half months on Is That Your Hair. I really hope you stick around for it. And if you wanna see some of my latest videos, check them out over here to the right of me. Thank y'all so much for joining me today for Tony All Tuesday, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.